Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. The close-in weapon system or CIWS is the last line of defense against any aerial threat. Since this gun is the last line of defense, the time to respond to any threat is very less. The gun needs to be highly agile with a very high rate of fire to ensure higher kill probability. The two prominent names in the CIWS among the world navies are Rathon Flanx CIWS and Rossborn Export AK630 CIWS or also known as Kastan CIWS. The CIWS used widely by Indian Navy in its warship is AK630. The gun used in this CIWS is GSH-30K having 6 barrel 30mm rotatory cannon. The GSH-30K has a higher rate of fire when compared to other guns used by other CIWS such as GAU-8 on the goalkeeper and M61 Vulcan on the flanks. This gun can fire over 10,000 rounds per minute. The missile used in Kastan are the 9M311 missiles. In combat mode, the gun mount operation is fully automated except for the belt filling and loading operations. The weapon is a modular system consisting of a command module and typically two combat modules. The command module detects and tracks the threats and distributes the target information to the combat modules and interrogates IFF of the approaching threat. The command module has a 3D target detection radar and an all-weather multi-band integrated control system. Depending on the number of installed combat modules, the system can engage multiple targets simultaneously. The combat modules automatically track either using radar or electro-optical control system or both and then engages target with missiles and guns. The combat models are typically equipped with two GSH-30K 6-barrel 30mm rotatory cannons fed by a linkless feeding mechanism and two 9M311-1 missile launchers equipped with four ready-to-fire missiles each fed by a reloading system storing 32 missiles in ready-to-launch containers. In past, DRDO has initiated the development of a multi-barrel Gatling gun with rate of fire of 4200 RPM. The Army wanted two types of air defense gun, one with weight around 1000 to 1500 kg and other around 4000 to 5000 kg with rate of fire of around 1000 to 2000 rounds in each case. However, the Gatling gun developed by DRDO did not meet the user requirement and this project was foreclosed in October 1995. Now recently, the DRDO's lab ARD has reinitiated the development of an indigenous multi-purpose Gatling gun which can be used in warship or land-based platforms. The gun is being developed considering the latest and future threat assessment and it will incorporate new technologies such as AI-based target engagement and damage assessment post-firing. The gun will be digitally operated with all electric drive and actuations. The target tracking will involve radar as well as UIR sensors. The system will have 360-degree revolving slip ring-based gun mount. It will feature ruggedized, digitally operated, embedded electronics, power electronics, controllers, sensors, drivers, thermal management and sensor to shooter logic. The gun will feature advanced stealth features which will include camouflage, concealment, firing signature management, detection avoidance and stealth operation. It will be using combustible cartridge and proximity or programmable fuse based ammo. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.